Hey guys, welcome back. So this is my client Lauren and she's coming today for a redesign. So I've done all the prep work on her natural nails and now we're going in with design. So I'm using, so this ring finger is gonna be um, a color block, if that's what you wanna call it, a color block nail. These nails were massively inspired by my favorite person my favorite nail tech Liz Guild um, so she has a video of these on her channel I'll leave a link in my um, description box but she just used um, more she used nudes and golds and I'm using I'm doing the same design but I'm doing pinks and silvers so there we go so yes she come in she was like I want these and I was like oh my god they're from Liz <laughs> I was like, this is my fave. She's like, oh my God, really? <laughs> <laughs> I've got American or whatever accent that is. So here I'm just picking up a more and I'm just creating that, at, creating that, placing that at the cuticle area and kind of like dragging halfway down and do it and then cutting it off in a slant. It was a slanted, slight slanted. It was slightly slanted, I think. Anyway, but I felt like mine wasn't very slanted in the end, but, but hey, whatever. I'm using my magic stick from Glitter Planet. Remember, if you use any of the products, um, if you buy any products from Glitter Planet, to use my code TRACY10, which gives you 10% off your entire order. So I'm just going to stop there, and once that's set, I'm going to come back, file it, you know the drill. So the baby finger is going to be an ombre, so I'm using a glitter ombre, glitter fade, whatever. So here I'm just going to pick up the same colour and more, place it in the cute curl and just blend down just to cover um, the colour of her natural nail underneath. So the middle finger is going to be a full now of Amour. This crazy not sound in the background. I've got my um, washing machine on, but I'm sitting next to Merlin's cage and he's just going to town on a monkey nut. I don't know, he doesn't even eat it. You heard, did you just hear, hear that little thing that hit the bottom of his cage? That was the monkey nut. He doesn't eat them. He just cracks them open and just more like eats the shell. What weirdo. Um, so yeah, I'm using um, just a nice full now of a more. I love a more. Um, it's such. It's just the perfect pink. I've probably told you this a million times, but it really is. If you if you don't have it in your collection, a more is a must have. Also, I just want to mention the ring finger. Um, she broke this finger. Oh, probably over a year ago now. I've been doing her nails for a long time, and she would come in with a broken finger. It was all plastered up, all like trying to like. Not a stent, I don't know what it's called, same way it's trying to force the bone back to the right position, and I'd still have to do her bloody nails. <laughs> she was like, I can't not have nails on, so I used to still do it, even though she had a broken finger. It took ages to heal, and every time her nail, because you can see that they're all her nails now, every time that nail grows, um, it's, wo it's wonky. And we, I was like, oh my god, let's get it off and start again, put a fresh tip on, um, and just hope that it's not wonky again but I put the tip on it didn't look wonky but now I filed it and and at the end it was so wonky again oh so next time she comes in for um a redesign I'm gonna take it all off again and I'm gonna put the tip on wonky and just hope it's, it goes against everything that I've ever done like you don't put a tip on wonky but I'm gonna just have to pull it on wonky and hope that it go it then looks straight. Like what the hell? She's not bothered. I'm not bothered, but I just wanna try and get it um straight. Just so we've got a nice picture at the end. And just so it looks nice really. But if you've got any tips, let me know. But I'm think I'm gonna do a wonky tip next time. So again on this pointy finger, it's just gonna be another glitter fade. So I'm just applying the pink at the cuticle area and dragging down. Um, and the thumb is just going to be another full now of a more.
So now I'm going in with a little bit of Drake. I know when the headline bling, that can only mean one thing. Yeah, bit of hotline bling from Glitter Planet. So I'm just picking up a nice wet small bead of acrylic, dipping into the raw glitter, and then just patting it and nudging it all into place until I'm happy. I'm gonna do that to the baby and the pointer offs. So now I'm just going to cap the baby and the pointer in crystal glass. I don't have to cap, um, I didn't cap the middle or the thumb because we all know Amour is a strength powder so we do not need to cap. So now I'm going to use my hand file and just make that line, that line, the end of the acrylic here nice and crisp, um, just so that when we bring our colour, our next colour up to it, um, it's just going to sit right under there and when you file with your e-file at the end, they're going to be the most crispest, crispy lines you've ever seen in your life. So remove all the dust and then I'm going to use Snow White and do this. just do the same sort of thing. Make sure you get right up into those nooks and crannies. <laughs> oh my god, nooks and crannies reminds me of Art Attack. Does anyone remember Art Attack? Coming from school, much Art Attack. Here's one I've done earlier. And that head. Remember the head? It's all just such madness. None of that stuff's on anymore, is it? It's just... But we used to come home, we used to watch Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Recess, um, The Queen's Nose. Oh my God, who remembers The Queen's Nose? Yeah, all these, I can't even think. Hey Arnold, hey football head. I used to love, I used to have an hour of watching telly after school and I, oh my God, it was just the best stuff. And they don't do anything like that anymore, do they? I've got Sky, but it's still not, it's just not the same. 
but anyway so now I'm going to do exactly the same thing as what I did with the pink just make it nice and sharp and crisp and then I'm going to come in with the same glitter that we used on um, the baby and the and the pointer finger the hotline bling and just put it at the tip and then I'll cap that end bit just the glitter really in crystal glass So now I'm going to come in with my e-file and just debulk and flatten out the cuticle area on all the nails, but I'm just leaving it in. Um, I'm just leaving in a clip of me doing the ring finger because it's just the best. It's just the best one when you see it come to life, girl. Oh, girl. Then I filed them all into shape, well, pff, this one, as much as I could, wonky, wonky donkey, oh my god, it's another TV program, god, I'm reminiscing today, wonky donkey on um, GMT, what, no, oh, I can't think what it's called, um, when it had Ant and Dec and Cat Daly on a Saturday morning, oh, the best, none of that is on either, is it, Gladiator, oh my god, let's go back, I used to watch Gladiator on a Saturday, it was sat SMTV, SMTV Live, that's it, um, and then I used to go out and we used to get, I used to get crab sticks and have them for lunch. And then we'd have fish and chips, but I'd have sausage and chips of an evening. Then we would watch Gladiator and then Blind Date and then it was bed. Yeah, that was my, that was my youth on a Saturday night. But anyway, so I've <laughs> top coated them all and cured them in the lamp for um, 60 seconds. Apply some cute coil and that is the set complete. I do hope you enjoyed this video um, please give me a thumbs up if you did and if you're not already subscribed to my channel please do and I'll see you in my next one bye